Good morning. Welcome to my YouTube channel. My name is Tony McKeg and this video is about country scenes. Now this morning it's just gone half past six and the sun is about to rise. I'm actually above Taihepe, about uh, 20 k's north of Taihepe on Spoons Hill Road. Now I've come here to today deliberately with a plan to photograph a small church. The issue at the moment is, is that I can barely see it with the naked eye and I don't think you will be able to see it with this GoPro. Uh, photographer's friend, Fog, is here. Uh, just in behind here is a small country Maori church sitting there. I'm hoping that um, eventually when the sun comes up that the cloud will, or the fog will disperse enough for me to get a photo. So it's certainly there, I can see it myself, but um, it's pretty much not able to be photographed at the moment. Thank you. In the meantime, while we're waiting for the cloud to clear, there is a group of cattle which have come out of the fog and are standing here in front of me. So it's a pretty murky sort of a, a scene, but hey, it's there. That's using the 70 to 200 um, at around about 70 at this stage. But I'm definitely going to need the 70 to 200 to get the church. Thank you. Well, the sun has come up and the church has come out of the fog. Only marginally, though. Um, there's some nice light on the memorials out to the left hand side and earlier the graves right in front of the church were being lit up. It's quite a quite a nice scene. Thank you. getting close to 7.30 now, we've been here for about an hour. At the moment, the, um, the church is shaded by those trees over there. Now, the question is, is just how long I'm going to have to wait for that edge of light to move up and go in, in around the church. Could be about another half an hour, I think. Um, I think it's worth it for that. The tree, the hills are coming in the background as the fog is being pushed away by air movement. I wouldn't call it wind. But I still quite like the effect that the fog has had so far. Thank you.
made it to Aotuni. Come through quite a bit of fog and it's mainly locale out here but it was quite dense fog. Uh, unfortunately it wasn't easy to stop on the main drag and take photo photos of trees but I'm just going to have a look around the village here and maybe if I can't see anything here I'll just wander a bit further afield because this fog is unusual and quite spectacular. Anyway, it's interesting, we're just at the railway station. Like a lot of the railways in New Zealand, they're starting to get a little bit tired. Um, that's the way things are. Thank you. I'm in Ratahi now and behind me on the top of the hill is a Ratna church. Now it's quite a photogenic subject and, and photographed quite a bit. But I'm going to try and have a go at a number of different positions um, or directions to see what I can get. Thank you. behind us is the Rakawa Falls and there it's on the falls are on the Mangafero River. I'm just going to take a quick shot here from the top. There's really no other position or composition that you can do but I kind of like to have a record of uh, waterfalls in my area and this is one of them. Thank you.